If you like our video, click the button to subscribe to our channel and get easy access to new content. To see our full suite of ad-free video courses, instruction manuals, and quick reference guides, visit us at www.teachucomp.com. Adobe Acrobat lets you easily save PDFs online to Adobe's cloud storage so you can share links to a PDF with others to view the PDF and or comment on the PDF. To share a PDF in Acrobat, open the PDF to share. Note that if the file is saved locally, Acrobat will upload a copy of the file to your Adobe Cloud Storage to share a link to the online file as part of the sharing process. Then, either click the Share button in the top bar, or click the Hamburger Menu button and select the Share File command. Either way, the Share panel then appears below the Share button in the top bar to show all your PDF sharing options. First, set the PDF link's sharing and security settings by clicking the Settings button in the lower right corner of the Share panel next to the link's current sharing and security settings to show the Share Settings panel. Select the desired option for the Who can access this file setting to choose who can access the PDF. To make a public link that doesn't require a user to sign into Acrobat to view it, select the Anyone with the Link option. Alternatively, to only allow invited users to view the PDF using a private link, select the Invited People Only option. If available, to share with all users in your organization who have the link, if you use an enterprise version of Acrobat, select the People in Organization's Name with the Link option. To toggle user commenting on or off for the shared PDF in Acrobat, click to enable or disable the People Can Comment option under the What Can They Do setting. If you didn't change the link settings, then click the Cancel button to return to the main Share panel, where you can then choose how to share the link. Alternatively, if you changed the commenting settings for a public or organization link, click the Apply button to return to the main Share panel, where you can then choose how to share the link. Alternatively, if you chose to create a private link, then click the Next button to continue to the Invite People screen. The Invite People panel lets you choose to whom to send an email containing the link you created. Only invited people can access the PDF online to view and comment on it. You must send them an invite to add them to the list of approved users. However, after sending them an invite and adding them as a user, you can then send the link to the file that is created using any of the other app sharing options too, if desired. Note that you can also access this panel by clicking into the Add Name or Email to Invite field in the main Share panel if you selected one of the other link options. To invite specific users to comment on the PDF in the Invite People panel in Acrobat, type the email address of a person to invite and then select them from the list that appears to then add them into a list above the field. Repeat this step to add the emails of all the users to invite in this email. To remove an email address you added, click the X button at the right end of the email address in this list. Alternatively, to invite people from your email application's address book, click the Address Book button select their names in the dialog box that appears, and click the To button for each, and then click the OK button to add them to the Invite People panel. Then replace the default email message text within the Message Optional field with the text you want to send along with the link to the file in the email. Note that you can also change the sharing links commenting at this point if needed by clicking the People Can Comment on This File toggle switch to set it either on or off. When you are ready to email the sharing link to the selected individuals, click the Invite button at the bottom of the Invite People panel, 
Acrobat then sends the invitations to the email addresses of the specified users. Separately, to share the link to the current PDF using Microsoft Outlook, Gmail, WhatsApp, Microsoft Teams, or as a direct link in an app you choose, click the Share button in the top bar of the PDF, and then click the Desired Apps button at the bottom of the Share panel. Acrobat then opens the app and provides a sharing link you can send to your desired recipients in the app. However, if you click the Copy Link button, Acrobat simply copies the sharing link to your clipboard, and you must then manually paste it into the desired app invitation you send. If a user tries to open a secured sharing link without having access to it, and they can switch to use an Adobe ID that has access, or they can click a Request Access button to send you a request for access. As the file's owner, you'll get a notification in Acrobat and by email of the request, and you can click the Manage Access button in either location, and then click Accept or Deny to accept or deny the sharing access request from the individual. Separately, to manage shared file access for a shared PDF in Acrobat, Click the icons for the invited users to the left of the Share button in the top bar to show a Shared With panel. The Shared With panel shows the users with whom you have shared the link via an invitation. To remove a user, hover over their name in the Shared With panel, and then click the Remove button that appears at the right end of their name. Then click the Remove button in the confirmation prompt. Alternatively, to stop sharing the PDF file with all users, click the Unshare link at the bottom of the Shared With panel. Then click the Unshare button in the confirmation prompt that appears. Note that if you share a locally saved file in Acrobat, Acrobat uploads it to Adobe's cloud storage to share it via a link. If you need to access the file in Adobe's cloud storage, it appears when you click the Your Files link under the Adobe Cloud Storage section in the panel at the left side of the home view in Acrobat. You can then click to select the file, and then choose your desired file management commands in the right panel that appears, like downloading or deleting the online file if needed. Users can view and or comment on a shared PDF using either a web browser, Adobe Acrobat, or Adobe Reader. They can simply click the link you send in the email or in one of the selected apps to open it within a web browser in Acrobat Online. If needed to access secured shared links shared with only selected individuals, they must then sign in to Adobe's site using the invited email address. They can then comment on the shared file using the tools in Acrobat Online. Alternatively, users signed in to Acrobat Pro or Acrobat Reader can find links to files shared with them under the Shared by Others section of the Adobe Cloud Storage section in the home screen which they can open to view and or comment on the file. Remember to click the subscribe button to see more of our videos. See our full suite of courses, instruction manuals, and quick reference guides at www.teachucomp.com.